Okay, we're just going to look at how to create some icons from the media section of the components in Pin Agenda. Put a heading on there, have a four column structure, and put some paragraph body text. Now, first of all, I go to the sections, and down the bottom, you will find the four column structure, which I drag up and put it on the body of the page. The first thing I will do then is go to the components, go to where it's got icon and drag and drop it, it goes blue and I put it on there. The first thing I'll do is just click here so the box turns blue with a border and I'll center it. Once I've centered it, I click on the icon. I go back over here and I put it on five times to just make it bigger and I'm gonna change the icon. So I click on there and I'll change it to this ambulance icon. Once I've done that, I'll drag out a header so I'll drag it out. I don't want that when it's got the line on the right. I'll just drag it under here so it puts it underneath. Now with that highlighted, I go over and change it to H3 in the settings. Then finally, I'll drag out a paragraph underneath and put that here. Right, so that's all centered and all placed. Now I could just then repeat the process by dragging everything out into the next columns or I can just click here so it's highlighted the whole um, sort of column here, right mouse click and then go down to plus clone node. Now that will then clone it into the next column and then I can come along and just delete that column if I wanted to. I'll just delete the next column as well. Now I'll do the same again to this column. I'll go here and right mouse click and plus clone and I've got that. And then finally I will do the same again if I can just click in here and I'll just um, I'll do this. I'll just click here delete that and finally again plus clone and it puts it there now if the sizes have gone out you can actually draw sort of drag these around to get them to snap back to equal sizes now they're all the same icons so i just click on there i can change it to another icon also i can change the color i'll make it a bit of a gray i'll go back here make that gray go here and quickly just click in here in the settings and again find um, another icon and again color it and finally I've got this one again from the bootstrap framework what it offers up I can come down here and I can click on another icon and then change its color to that so that's quite simply how you could lay up a component like that really easily you can then put proper English text on there rather than body text and change these around, but that's how you would lay out this component.